Scary music, please. Remember what you were told? Now the nightmare begins. Now the oath is sworn. You've got to conform. Is it a way of life or a way of death? The way they make me feel. Suppression of your creativity is a suppression of your DNA. Remember what you were told. Now the nightmare begins. Once bitten, twice shy. You're in a worth you can't deny. Then you had to go and eat humble pie. Suppression of your creativity is a suppression of your natural born gifts. Remember what you were told. Now the nightmare begins. Once bit twice shy, you're in a worth you can't deny. Then you had to go and eat humble pie. Suppression of your creativity is a suppression of your natural born gifts. Now the nightmare begins. When spent and twice shy, you're in a word you can't deny. But now you're gonna have to eat humble pie. Suppression of your creativity is a suppression of your DNA. So play dead, play dead. That's the trap you've been fed. Since the day you were born, you never cried, you never grieved, or wore your heart on your sleeve. So in order to survive, and in order to lead a happy life, in order to stay alive, you've got to play, you've got to play dead. Suppression of your creativity means you don't upset the order or chain of command. Remember what you were told. Now the oath is sworn. They taught me what was right and what was wrong and what to feel and what was real. The things I never knew. Do I lose my soul or obey the protocol? This form of thought control can really take its toll. Of your creativity can leave you feeling rather inadequate to say the least. I don't wanna play no more, I don't wanna play no more. But it's time that I even look. Score. Gifts, I have talents. I have a purpose and a need to fulfill. I want to create amazing things. I'm right now tapping into my full creative potential. The negative beliefs no longer serve me. And I have valid ideas and I'm worthwhile. So you don't want to play dead. Do you do it up, pop it up, it up, pop it up, it up?